Good morning. Eric's doing laundry. Yes, I'm going to wash my backpack and I don't know if it's a good idea. Okay, water bottles, computer, lunch. Let's get out the house. Go so much stuff. like do an impromptu dance performance on their stage they said no we're about to facetime my mom because it's her birthday today hi babs she doesn't know that it's going to be all of us <laughs> hi i haven't forgotten happy birthday so i've got a couple of people who want to say hello oh So now is the moment where we're going out into Union Square and we're gonna do our dance routine. Which I'm really excited for. Let's go, shall we? Yes, let's go. I think so. We're about to go ball out. We're about to go ball out in Union Square and do our We Dance Day in the middle of the square with all of these eyes on us. And I'm feeling excited and it's a beautiful day. And we're gonna rock it, right?
I'm lying on the floor. It's lunch time. People are out in the park. And I just wanted to say hi to uh, username is Team Adam, but I think the name is Miriam, who is in Spain. He wanted to join us for the We Dance Day, but couldn't because she lives in Spain, obviously. But I imagined you there with us. And let me know if you want to come dance with us. Leave me a comment under this video if you're in New York or where you are. Maybe I can come visit you and we can do a big We Dance Day in your city. Vlog. So we were just talking about my knee and like superhuman weight loss and superhuman fitness and I had this amazing experience. Obviously I've been doing lots of movement which has been awesome. Really picturing just squishy, bouncy knees. And today when we were dancing, the last dance, went to go do a movement and just like pop, this big pop happened in my knee. And now I have this massive new long stretch and movement in my knee. It was like, whatever, for whatever reason, my body put that there to protect. And then boom, now it's gone and I have a new knee. That's freaking amazing. And it's amazing. So it's like when someone tells you that you can't heal your knee, that you will not be able to walk again the way you were, that you're gonna have chronic knee issues, tell them that it's bullshit. And that, and then come to Laura because if you can see the body and know that you are you got it and know that you can heal, it that's all it is. It's just that. And it, it will shift. And through all of it, I was telling Elizabeth, through all of it, two and a half months of like, not my normal movement. I was on a, like, sort of a journey of losing weight and like, you know, finding my best health. And so with my knee injury, there was a lack of movement. And with it, because the way I've lost weight in the past, I haven't gained a pound. I haven't, you know, it hasn't been like this, oh, re-experience, like, oh no, I'm gonna gain all my weight back or anything like that. In fact, I've lost and I've shifted other parts of my body and it's, it's just amazing. It's just like amazing. a whole amazing, all the whole pieces of it. Yeah, and your body can do it. It definitely can. And there's a whole bunch of bodies in here. Who can testify. Exactly. <laughs> I have a goal I'd like to share. I was, I was telling Jess and Rachel earlier um, that my goal for the Hawaii retreat, which is about a year from now, is I want to wear booty shorts and a midriff top during the workouts. And that would be really big for me. And not just wear it, but I want to feel really amazing and fit while wearing it. Rachel and me are going to be buddies and and yeah, I'm going to do superhuman fitness. I feel really good each day we do this and earlier um, we were talking for a while before banding and I was like, oh, I really don't want to ban and that's how I was feeling and you voiced that and then we banned it and then I did feel amazing and then we're out doing the We Dance Day and I'm like, woo, 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 right? And it's just, you know, again and again, these experiences with the movement here and feeling the total resistance to doing it and all the stuff that comes up every single day. Usually I, you know, I try to, I haven't been doing this stuff though. I haven't been doing the banding and the ball. Like real, or like a real workout. Yeah. But this being available, I'm like, okay. Like a real workout with the ball. Yeah. So. This is me from like day one of Grand Cayman. This is me the day after we got back, and then this is me the day before UHP. So April 27th, day 12. Yeah! Wow. Wow. This is Superhuman Fitness and just committing to like my best self every day. I also didn't have any photos of myself in a bathing suit because I never wanted to ever show it. So I took this from the vlog because that was the only like exposed bikini shot I had. And since then have just really been embracing the feeling. Like in sessions, like 
embrace it all and let it all be seen because when it's seen it can shift and I think that that's the biggest thing about UHP it's like it's really not about like doing this onto clients it's about the experience you have for yourself mm -hmm. and this is what I just am excited to see all the other future versions and this is why I'm here and doing this mm -hmm. and I feel like that's we all just want that in some way or another for ourselves too so mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Thank you for making my dream come true, mm. everybody. Mm. And may we all make our dreams come true, or let our dreams come true. <sighs> Thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone on the vlog. All of our dreams can absolutely come true because this is Laura's dream and we're in it. And the fact we went and like danced in the every day. We're going to go to Hawaii and dolphins are like, and it's going to be like, documented on the vlogs and yeah I mean it's not a like small big, you know vision <laughs> <laughs> and Caitlin's gonna move in next door and we'll have big dance parties money's gonna flow to the whole next level with everyone For everybody like I see us being such an abundant community mm -hmm. of body first and then I experienced Find the joy paying my bills the other day, yeah. and I was just, you know, my mind boggles a little bit every time I see my rent amount. I'm like, <laughs> you know, but then I'm like, bigger numbers. They're just bigger numbers. That's it. Yeah. And then it's like. I'm like, also interested how it all evolves, and like everybody's like why each and every person is here, and each and every person's perspective, and the, mm -hmm. you know, we, that's also really, really fun. Gold fingers, baby. It's the end. It's the end of you. Of you each year. Look at how pretty we look. We've had so many lovely hugs with everyone, and yeah. so many sweet moments, and so many thanks and gratitude, and thank you for your vision, and thank you for our vision, and I was like thank you to everyone on the vlog, and thank you to everyone in Holy Shift and yeah. HB and everything, the whole process, the whole it. journey, and may everyone just feel feeling. Yeah, that is love. No, it doesn't, and it's not always like. The, like the frontal cortex is not always like the easy choice to do the thing that actually feels good which is so counterintuitive but yeah. so totally true you know what Judy just told me what she's like you have changed so much she's like yeah. you're you're not jittery anymore right. she's like you're really grounded I was like really grounded I'm like thank you I mean it's like I know it but then to have it reflect because Judy's been here forever you want to yay, yay Susan. Susan it's been an amazing five days um, I was gently stretched uh, mm -hmm. beyond my normal comfort zone. Mm -hmm. uh, wonderful uh, exercises with the Franklin Method, the banding and the balls. Um, we did some fabulous dancing in Union Square. Yes. I hadn't done that for decades. And my advice is, um, if you're at all inclined to join UHP or join the Laugh World, please do. Mm -hmm. uh, you'll fit right in. It's a wonderful, supportive mm -hmm. group. Um, facilitated by Laura, who's amazing. Mm -hmm. um, great information, great inspiration, and uh, the next two years I'm sure will be very, very Yay. exciting. Watch this space. Yeah. Top notch, baby, Whoa. top notch. Love you guys. Seamer heads. I'm gonna. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. I'm going to teleport home. I know, I gotta go. <laughs> One, two, I got three, go. Me. <laughs> cool. We're going to the Tony viewing party with the Bright Star cast. So we're going to watch them perform and then hang out with them. We'll see you there. So excited. And if you want to be on Broadway, you have to work hard. You have to study for years and find the perfect story to tell. Or you can do what I did, already be famous. Here's Tony Dominique Holy Cusack. Yeah.
Because you haven't met every all the new peoples. Yeah. Hi everybody. I'm Bennett. This is Bennett. He stars in the Star movie. Bright Star. Musical. It's not a movie. <laughs> it's a musical. I'm really tired. Everybody, subscribe to Laura's channel because she's awesome.